Welcome to Martini Time Talk Show with your exotic host, Nadia Ward. Today, we're talking X-rays and XYZ teenies with special guest, Patrick Laurie. Welcome to the Martini Time Talk Show. Yeah. I'm your host, Daniel Ward, and today I have a really great guest with us. He is an actor and writer. This is Patrick Laurie. Hello. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers. Uh, Patrick, tell me a little about yourself. Tell me what you're working on. Uh, I had a movie come out earlier in the year, uh, VHS 3. Uh, it was in the movie theaters. Uh, oh, cool. What is it? What do you do in it? Uh, it's a horror movie. It's kind of chasing my girlfriend around. She gets a little bit possessed. So. It gets pretty. It gets pretty messy. Do you have a girlfriend in real life? I do not. Oh, cheers. Our letter of the day is X. X. So we're talking about X-rays. What I did was I found X-rays with like weird things inside people's bodies. <laughs> okay. So this is the first picture. Oh God. So this is a light bulb. Yeah. For some reason, a lot of this happens to people that are in prison. But anyway, this guy was this guy was in prison and put a light bulb in his rear end, or somebody did it to him. Not sure. And when they took it out, he acted just as surprised as the doctors were. He was like, what? You know, uh, I can kind of see where he's coming from a little bit. You know, maybe in the middle of the night, his, uh, his colon has had a bright idea. <laughs> this one I think makes a little more, bit more sense, especially for a prisoner, but it's still crazy. That's his cell phone. Oh. A, that could not have been fun, but B, I kind of understand where he's coming from. Yeah, you, know? you want to be in contact with people. Right. And but B, where's the charger? Like, how long can you really use this phone right. for? Right, but I mean, if you're in prison, I mean, even 20 minutes playing Snake, I assume that's why he got the phone in there. To play Snake. Um, also, let's check in with Rod and the freaks and see what we're drinking today. Rod? You got yourself an XYZ martini. You want to take two parts rum, one part triple sec, squeeze a lime, lime and lemon, give it a shake, 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 strain it in your teeny glass, and then you want to enjoy the fact that you don't need to go to the doctor today and get an x ray, because you're going to be enjoying too many martinis and doing bad things with things in your house. Mm. You can't even really taste the alcohol, which makes it better. <laughs> so I'm going to go to the next picture. Okay. Uh, what is that? Buzz Lightyear. Oh. <laughs> Somebody put Buzz Lightyear in their butt. <laughs> Woody must be pissed. <laughs> what does Woody have to do to get some love? He's not gonna get taken. He won't get taken anywhere. No, uh, he won't get taken to college. He won't get taken up a rectum. Like, what is? What does he ask for anymore? I don't get it. Yeah. Why does Buzz get everything? No, Buzz Lightyear is like to infinity and beyond, and maybe this is the beyond. Oh, this is more. This is beyond. <laughs> This is just the infinity and behind. <laughs> um, everybody, thank you so much for coming to Martini Town. We have a single handsome guy here today, Patrick. Cheers. So thank you for coming to Martini Town. And everybody out there, thanks for coming to Martini Town. Fine, talk show. <laughs> we'll see you next time.